step out on the patio and follow where your daddy -o is leading. Tonight I have new things to show you, new places. This is South Park, the stick of truth. And this is my very first time playing this. And I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty excited. South Park is one of my favorite shows. I, at, at some point, have seen every episode. Like, I don't remember a lot of them because I, I, I remember I watched like three or four whole seasons while I had the flu. So memories of those seasons maybe aren't too strong, but I'm a big South Park fan. So, let's follow where the daddy -o is leading. Robert T. Pooner presents a Pooner Pictures production. Deep what? in the lands of Zaran, the humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drow elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them. A noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, <laughs> the Drow Elf armies continue their attack. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war soon change, as news of a new king Blizzard's gonna sue someone. Land. In order to <laughs> so save the humans, Tolkien estate. the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid before the Drow Elves can manipulate his man and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick controls the universe. Oh, yeah. And then immediately after that amazing... An epic opening. I am granted with a bald, naked baby. Well, it's underpants baby. Burp, burp. Look, there's an option for Jersey Shore. Um, I'm not gonna do the spray tan. God, I can do an afro. Cornrows. I think, um, I think I'm just gonna kind of go for <laughs> this is the emo. Oh man, perfect, perfect. No, I'm gonna go for this. This is it's perfect for me. And uh, yeah, there you go. All right. So, what default clothing I'm, I'm trying to think of what I would wear out of these clothes. I guess I would wear this. But that's kind of boring, isn't it? Yeah, that's that's all right, I guess. That's cool. Secondaries is fine. Just the way it is. Oh. <laughs> Look at these nice options. Little butt on your heist down. Is this just shit? Is is just it's just shit. Okay. A tear. He's killed someone in prison. A scar, of course. Scars are cool. Black eye. There's no... I don't think there's facial hair. There, there is shit, but there's no facial hair. And there's glasses. I look... Like, that looks just stoned, Vinny. But I'm gonna try to make this as close to me as possible. So let's... let's... let's do it. Perfect. Just like watching an episode of the show. 
while we wait for the new season, this will be good to tide us over. Is the volume okay, by the way? Well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. we We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? My character is special. Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but... It's an escaped son, convict. Do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? Um... He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's My good, character that's good looks traumatized. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right, get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. <laughs> he looks paranoid. Yeah, <laughs> we love you too. Just out of curiosity. Okay, cool. Oh, there's a run button. I have a fish. I'll name him Nemoid. Nemo and Nareed and Leonard Nemoy all together. Some cash, 50 cents, and some baseball cards. I love this already. I really do. It's perfect. It looks just like an episode. I love it. My character is in a permanent state of never having slept. I wonder how much fat cash Matt and Trey got for this UPS tie-in. Pants box. It's just a box of pants. Old sponge. Old sponge. That's metal sponge solid four. That's that's what he becomes. Old sponge. That. Eh. Okay. That makes it <laughs> makes sense for a South Park game. Just like in Metal Gear Five, I can shower with all my clothes on. Oh man. Take the shit. Oh, well, I can't take the shit now. You can collect the poop. Oh, I can't now. Will I have another chance to pick up poop? I missed it. Ah, oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. I. You know what? I shouldn't apologize to you. I. I feel. I feel robbed. I feel deprived of an opportunity to pick up shit. Yes, people are saying that there is more shit. You'll have plenty of chances to get poop. Thanks, bro. <laughs> That's good, good advice. Eye black. Health potion, small. Go on outside, sweetie. Go look around the neighborhood. Go on outside, sweetie. Fork. You never know when a fork is going to come in handy. It can be used as a weapon, as we've learned, in Metal Gear Solid 3. It Three. wasn't a request, it was a command. Now get out there and make some friends. No wonder my character looks... Insanely paranoid and without sleep. His father's a dick. Let 
It looks to be it's something hidden behind behind there. You see that? There's like a bag. I can't get it though. Quest log. Okay. Oh, I can punch the snow. I can't do anything yet. Maybe I have to come back. My father, speaking of, my father was um, arguing with my grandmother recently. This is another sign number three that you're getting old. My grandmother used the word consistency in relation to um, pasta sauce, saying the consistency was good. And my father was like, I never heard a word like that before, used in that way. You shall die by my warhammer, Drow Elf. Nuh-uh. I banish thee to the forest realm. That way, I banish you first. Ha-ha! <laughs> you can't hold out much longer! So... Help! Somebody! I can't hold out much longer! Help! I'll help you, Butters, in a second. So, um... Ow! Ow! Ouch! Stop, Butters. Sorry. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Butters, please. So, I, I... They just argued for, like, five minutes about this. Like, that's a sign that you're getting old when... When you don't... When you don't have anything else to argue about but the definition of a word, and instead of using the cell phone to check it out, she's like, I never heard that. Just like, like, arguing. So my grandmother's like, Vinny, what's this word mean? Am I using it right? I was like, I am not getting involved in this. And then finally I felt bad, and I looked it up, and I read the definition to my father. He's like, I never heard that before. And then days later, he, he claimed that it was, it was a made-up definition. <laughs> Guys, so I have good news. According to my father, the internet's wrong. We can all go home now. Yeah, I deserve that. Sorry for hurting your sword. Take that, human. Feel my wrath. Why? Uh, hey, no fair. That's cheating. I'm gonna tell my mom. Thanks, kid. I didn't realize he had a health potion. My name is Butters the Merciful. I'm a paladin. I live right next door to you. We should be friends. Message from your friends. Show up in the home page to see all your friends you made. Use LT or RT to move the collection. Now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Okay. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? Um... Is that Colorado? I, I lived in Staten Island. And yeah, Colorado's pretty cool. It's fucking cold, though. Not a big fan of snow. <laughs> it's Cartman. So, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. <laughs> oh, this is good. This oh, is really this good. Is new friend, Eric. Shut up, Mom. Not now. Hi, Mrs. Cartman. Evil Cartman goatee. Apartment's garage key. Oh, come a game sphere! And cash. You can't watch that, Mrs. Cartman. It's trash. It'll it'll ruin your it'll ruin your uh your life. And Don't stuff. talk to her, she's not part of the game. Don't talk <laughs> to her, she's not part of the game. Okay, Eric. Um, but you know. I've seen what she did. I know what she's done, Eric. Please. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Do not infringe on Our Nintendo's rights. Koopa Keep Clark, copyrighted Nintendo. Warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. Hello, Clyde. That's the line the Grand Wizard gave me. Sorry, but the Grand Wizard told me to stick to the script. Ah, you have located the training area where our massive army learns to fight. 
They hit dummies. You know what? That's every Wizard training stump. area. Perhaps one day I will show you what it does. Some say he who discovers the secret of the wizard stump is the master of his own destiny. I figured it out the other day. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. As my diabetes. <laughs> the power of diabetes is both a gift and a curse, but mostly a curse. Diabetes. The Grand Wizard would hold snacks if we talk off script. Stick to your the power of diabetes. No is talking, both a gift. Be careful. The Rock of Insanity holds Mr. Okay. Okay, you're insane now. If you want to be healed, you must gaze at the rock again. Okay, I want to be healed. Okay, you're healed. Okay, thanks, Eric. <laughs> the pool of vision. Ah, yes, the pool of vision. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, okay, I just picked up a quest item. Oh, this game is going to be awesome. My fairest Kenny. <laughs> I brought a daffodil for you. Someone's going to get offended at this game. If South Park is not your speed, you might want to head off. You might want to come back for a more reserved stream. Say Metal Gear Solid 5, where I gore people in the face with high-powered machinery and weapons. Weapons of mass gore and destruction. But I know someone would complain about the diabetes and the speech impediment thing. I know it but is a that's, massive that's, kingdom, but you'll learn to find your way around. No one complains about me shooting people in the head or like drilling someone in the face with a drill. Perhaps one day I will show you what it does. But you know, just just your one disclaimer, your one warning, and that's it. You have that's been it. sought out. It's over. Warning over. Are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest. But first, please tell us thy name. Oh. You entered um, Douchebag, is that correct? Yes. Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. <laughs> this is good. A Mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A White Fighter? Haven't seen a good one of those in a while. A Mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A White Thief? Never heard of one, but interesting. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. <laughs> Why is Jew a class? <laughs> Let's see. I heard the fighter is the, the most, you know, the easiest class. You look sneaky um, enough to be a thief. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. I don't know if I should be the Jew. I heard some bad things about the Jew. Straw poll. You know what? I don't need to make a straw poll for this because I know what you guys are going to choose. It's going to be, you want me to be a Jew. Jew passive ability, hide gold in a bag tied around your neck. Oh God, is that real? Jew is on the tougher side, but the game is not that hard. Okay. It's an enjoyable class. A white thief? Never heard of one, but interesting. Mage has some funny abilities. Jew is all about bleed debuffs. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. Welcome to the KKK douchebag to Jew. Of course I'm going to be a Jew. Our finances. Hooray! I have now no please, choice. Now go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. I have to. I, someone said, I've seen too many Jew playthroughs. Oh my god, I, I guess that makes sense. Can I reclass, Eric? You know Eric? what procure means, right? That's old English for bad. Go buy a weapon from Clyde. You know what procure means, right? I just That's realized, yeah, I'm sure everyone that has played through this game has become a Jew at some point. How do you, uh, <laughs> shalom, motherfuckers. How do you reclass? Is there a way? Or do I have to just restart? Go buy a weapon for Clad. Don't let it bother you that there's a game to be. Hang on. <laughs> Holy robes. Gain one PP when you take damage. 
you've only seen he played Jew playthroughs. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be a Jew. I'll tell you why I don't want to be a Jew. This game's been out for a while. And everyone is a Jew. So I'll tell you what, we had a moment. It was fun for a second. But I'm not gonna be a Jew. You may have I'm sorry, my guys. At the Battle of Stark's Pod. That's the line the Grand Wizard. Sorry, but the Grand Wizard told me to stick to the script. That's the line the Grand Wizard. Sorry, but the Grand Wizard told me to stick to the script. As court paladin, my job is to deliver the Wizard King's justice and his mail. As court paladin, my job is to. <laughs> okay, I'll give Kenny the thing. There we go. New friend request from Kenny. Be a thief. Thief sounds good. Yeah, I'll be a thief. You have been that sounds fun. Out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, who do you I'm play to mage? To allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest. But first, please tell us thy name. Yeah, I'll be a thief. That sounds that sounds like fun. You entered douchebag. Is that correct? Are you sure you want to keep the name douchebag? Very well, douchebag. <laughs> no matter what, your douchebag. Like only not a white thief. Never heard of one, but interesting. <laughs> we welcome yeah. to our kingdom. Stood thief sounds the good. Thief. Hooray! Now please go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon, and we shall teach you to fight. Oh. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? No. Just just your wares. Um, rogue's dagger. <laughs> Jewish staff. <laughs> Jesus fucking ah, Christ. A lovely purchase. This game. But don't let it bother you that there's a game to be played. Weapon strap-ons. <laughs> You have procured a weapon. Yes. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and I'll buy the, with the bravery of a noble knight. Beat up Clad. What? Kick Clad's ass, new kid. What I do? I'm the king, Clad, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid, kick his ass. Alright, so this is the combat system. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clad, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clad. I know it's lame, Clad, but that's how we're fucking doing it. <laughs> I right, guarantee you. Face in. Don't be shy. I guarantee you that's not how that happened. Oh. It's like Mario RPG. Ah. I dodged that. Oh, I gotta that figure out how got? to make this work. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I'm, it's butters all over again. <laughs> okay, look. Try putting your back into it at the last possible moment. <laughs> Your bitch. There All you right, go. Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Power attack. Kick. Oh shit, dude! I think I see blood. Fucking nice, bro. It's exactly <laughs> what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bows. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bows. Protect my bows. Prepare yourself. This does double damage. No, no, I said protect. Protect your bows. Oh, sorry. Right. Pressed it a little late. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already way better than Clad. Blocking reduces some damage, right? All right. right. Very Mario your RPG. Powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clad. Fucking asshole. I'm the king, and I say it's PP. Douchebag, use your thief ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. Uh, slips it into the last enemy in a row, dealing heavy damage. Come on, fight! Six PP. Didn't count! Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him! 
What? I was going easy. He's Take actually this. like legitimately this is bleeding. Like. Uh, I, I wasn't good, good enough. I wasn't fast enough at blocking, guys. He's dead. That's it. Clyde is dead. He'll never be on the show again. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome. You were all like, and Clyde was all like, nah, nah. <laughs> okay, okay. You prove yourself worthy, douchebag. <laughs> now come inside the war tent and I shall. That's really my name. Back. That is really my name, douchebag. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two. Don't waste your money on tips and rumors. You asshole. Y you know what? You guys are assholes. Buy the tip, Vinny. Buy the tip, Vinny. Well, here it is. The reason why human and elf are locked in a never-ending war is the relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The stick of truth. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. <laughs> for whoever controls the stick controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long, for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the stick of truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week, $4 of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! Defensive position! Oh. Um, yeah, so that orc is actually a blow-up doll, isn't it? Douchebag, come help us! <laughs> The orc's boner vibrates. <laughs> Help us, new kid. Don't steal that yeah, shit in there. Yeah, well, I'm taking your shit. This is the first time I'm playing this game, yes. Sure wish that new kid would fucking help us. <sighs> Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, humans! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Clyde, guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye, aye! Aye, aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Douchebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! Oh, you want some of this? Ugh! They're role-playing as elves. I mean, come on, couldn't they go for orcs or something if they wanted to steal the stick? Do Why it, elves? Kick these elves' asses! You're wounded, douchebag. Potions will heal you. Here. I gotta use it now. Yeah. Cheesy poofs. So use one item and still attack. Okay, one Blue item and one still attack. Every turn. I asked for five, but this was coming. That's cool. This guy's fast, douchebag. Try to block all his attacks. Suck my balls. Well, if this job doesn't work out, at least you've got a future as a training dummy. Come on, get it right! I did! Suck it! <laughs> okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack! Look at your enemy on the ground, weak and helpless! Kick the shit out of him! <laughs> awesome, you That's kick awesome! Help this now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King! Why don't you Kiss help out, Carmen? Ass. Fuck! I have enough PP to finish. Um, that might be overkill, actually. Wait, whose turn is it? Yeah, it's overkill. That does a lot of damage, though. Great job, douchebag. This is pretty cool. I like this. I like this a lot so far. Bow of sucking. <laughs> Son of a biscuit! Butters! Ugh. Butters, you're losing! Stop losing! But, but I don't want to make him feel bad! Don't you dare Kick hurt ass. Cartman's Kick cat. I, got you back. I came home today and, and the neighborhood cat was like on my front step. You got this, and it, it, it got scared and when it saw me, so I, I approached slowly and it let me pet him. I now have AIDS. What are you waiting for, douchebag? That guy's just standing there. Go kick his ass. Oh, oh. Totally for you, dude. you can't just hit him like that. 
counterattack melee weapons. Use arrows or abilities to against him. To damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrows, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mist. Uh, yeah, bitch, yeah. that's for fucking with the wizard king. Yeah. Get that. Also, yeah, I can tell you. Guys ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else. Use abilities or melee attacks against them, right? Okay. So I can tell you for a fact that the stream is seeping into my. You lied to me, Cartman. What the fuck? Seeping into my real life because someone was like riding up my ass while I was driving. Like, the dude was right behind me and going really, really fast. And I'm like, yeah! Yeah, go fast! On, yeah! Yeah, right up my ass! And when he finally tried to pass me, his, Wait, um, window was open. And I, I went, yeah! <laughs> he looked at me. Hurry All right. Up. Right, Melee, sorry. I was thinking about my story that I wanted to tell you guys. Sorry about that. Douchebag. It's terrible. I, I really, I, I gotta stop doing the yeah. Sonic voice. <laughs> it, it, oh shit! Yeah. Sorry, cat. Oh shit! Let's do this, douchebag. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. Nope. Ah, ah that's nice. That's how you do it. The other nice. elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. Stop it. That's it. Now finish him. <laughs> right up the ass. Uh, Jesus, I love this game. Oh, it's on. Quit it. Okay, that wasn't enough to finish him. Now. Yeah, there you go. I'm getting it, little by little. Yeah, but when the dude passed after Rollo, I did the... Yeah! Rollo. He, he looked confused and angry. Yeah, awesome, dude. Take but, that, you asshole elves. Better luck next time. Na, 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 na. We still control the universe. <laughs> it's God. What? The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde. To guard the stick of fucking truth. Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time. What? No, you can't do that. Yeah, I can. You're banished and lost in time and space. Yeah, go home, Clyde. You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. Yeah, this dude can make me a douchebag, like you sure can't fight. Shut up, Scott. Nobody cares what you think. Anyways, <laughs> we have a bigger problem now. The stick of truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors. Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But beware. The lands outside are full of marauding drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go! And send my warriors here! Spiders, go with him. Guess I'm minding your shop now. You need any weapons or armor? I love this guy's voice. Here. He's got new things, guys. Um... I could... I could buy this. This looks cool. Can I use other weaponry, or is it best to stick with a, um, you know, your class's weapon? And sixth graders are fucking terrifying, yeah. Go 
Давай. Weapon strap ons adds uh, 10 shock damage. That's fine. Let's yeah. get that's uh, that's a strap on that I can't use yet, but I will be able to. Bandage and cut. Celtic battle paint. Halfling wig. Also new to his poodle mullet. Looks good despite chronic abortion addiction. <laughs> Cartman comb over. Comb over is the only way to get through to these kids. Perfect for looking tough or getting your parents in trouble with social services. <laughs> oh, sorry, Celtic. Isn't it um the the fucking basketball team? Isn't it pronounced Celtics? That's how you pronounce it, isn't it? That's yeah, Celtic, Celtic. I don't know. I just know from the fucking basketball team. You name it, we'll sell it. Here's what we're selling today. Okay, so I have a, a strap on here. Press X to modify the strap on. Ah, oh, okay. Put the end. Press X to remove it. So I can't use it yet, right? Because I'm not leveled enough. I need level three to put this strap on in here. Hey, I didn't get Clyde's friend request. Oh, shit. I guess I got it before and I didn't get it back this time. Damn it! Uh, equipment. Clyde's helmet. KKK gloves. Amazing. It's an amazing name name for a, an armor, piece of armor. KKK gloves. I wonder what it, KKK stands for in, in this context. Wait, can I sell this junk? Or does this, um, does this stuff come in handy at any point? How may I be of service? You name it, we'll sell it. Junk is just plain for selling, okay. Um, alright. What you? You and me to fight with you? Okay, this paladin is ready to kick some ass. What you? You and me to fight with you? Okay, this paladin is ready to kick some ass. Okay, fast travel. Fast travel has been unlocked. <laughs> Honk. Um, call the banners. Go to Tokens Fancy House and talk to him about joining you. Um, so this is South Park, huh? Canada. <laughs> like how Canada is connected to Colorado. <laughs> You kids be careful now. Got a friend request from Cartman's mom. Ooh. Oh. Ow. Oh. <laughs> All right, so how do I call Cartman's mom? I, I need to talk to her about something. I, I need to, uh, you know, just say what up. Got mug now. 
Oh, there's perks too. F new friends needed for next perk. Oh, that's how you get perks? You have to get friends? Yeah, fuck your shit up. <laughs> that's not really that nice. I realized today why I would not make a good father. It's because I was walking into Target and some, you know, brother and sister, little kids with their mother, and they're walking and, and they're like, you know, the brother's like, I want five guys and fries. And the mother's like, oh, well, honey, they're expensive. And the little girl goes, yeah, the burgers are like $30. And I'm like thinking to myself, you liar. You, you liar. You know the burgers aren't $30. She must have been like five years old. And that's when, that's when it hit me in my head. I was like, yeah, nope, I would not make a good father. <laughs> it's like, there is no reason for me to be telling myself that this kid is a liar. But it was, uh, it was a funny thought. I actually chuckled about it. <laughs> I had a good, I had a good laugh to myself. Like, yep. Uh, yep. This is the king's room. Shh, you lying, you game. lying kid. What you, exactly you, are you looking for? Uh, I'm looking for some stuff. I don't know. It's in Miss Cartman's room. A meal for three at Five Guys is about $30. Okay, that's true, actually. So you have a point. So maybe I'm the asshole because... <laughs> okay, uh, you can show my yellow arrow. Your quest objectives. Right. Got it. There's the sea monkeys. I like how Cartman just has a picture of Mr. T. Polly Prissy Pants. <laughs> Oh god, all the things from the episodes. Everything is just coming back to me. Double chin. The Kern. Who is the Kern? Oh my god, look at all this stuff. This is just like a treasure trove of South Park trivia. I am Asime. There's the coon outfit. <laughs> Beefcake. Oh my god. Wow, Eric has a lot of cool stuff. My guy looks like Dante from Clerks. He actually kind of does. Underpants. Cash. Bl Black Thunder. Alright, I'm done. See you later. Goodbye. Purple Passion. The Jackrabbit. <laughs> oh my god. Hey. Yo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna text Mrs. Cartman like, yo, hey, boo. Yo, I saw that Jackrabbit. Hi. Yo, y'all, y'all wanna watch some Netflix? <laughs> Black Thunder often teamed up with White Lightning. Jackrabbit, a strange toy that realistically simulates the shaking of a frightened rabbit. Oh, that, yes, that's, that's indeed what it does. Purple Passion, grape flavored. This is where the magic happens. Last week, Cartman's mom was here with a few men having a whole lot of magic. She was doing hand magic and butt magic. What was that, Butters? <laughs> Lube? Fucking Cartman's mom is smoking crack rock, cocaine. There's a bong and there's another vibrator <laughs> behind the fucking picture. Oh, we're not done yet. There's even more crack pipe, uh, wig purple dye, Antonio Banderas love doll, and the milkman. Oh, uh, Mrs. Cartman never change. Butt magic, cock magic. I have, um, I have dye now, right? So I can dye one of my pieces of clothing to be...
There you go. Look how beautiful and cute I am. That wasn't very nice. This is where karma does magic. Hmm, smells like the wizard is brewing some potion in here. Some wizards do. Oh, looks like he forgot to flush this dude. If it splashes, it means you get a free wish. <gasps> Shit nugget. Thanks. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Yeah, I'll take that. Whoa. Hey. That, that's what Randy does when he does cock magic. The milkman, not named for its color. Crack pipe, engraved with Cartman's mom's initials. Antonia Banderas love doll with lifelike chest hair and real from real Spaniards. <laughs> oh, man. Packet of sea people. Cash and pubes. You can sell pubes for five cents, apparently. This is good. AIDS. We must Sherrick. get back to the question hand, my lord. Oh, <laughs> remember this episode. Oh. Oh, this game is going to kill me with laughter. <laughs> oh, whoops. I'm sure that was an accident. I'm sure you didn't mean to do that. They're watching Terrence and, Terrence and Philip. Broken sword hilt. No. Oh. We aren't allowed to go into the streets. When it's such an open world, our parents don't want us getting hurt. Can't pass the rats. <laughs> you can't go into the street and you can't pass rats. Okay. Bullshit game. Zero out of ten. The Wizard King says I'm too ginger to be one of the humans, but Paladin Butters lets me be his squire on the sly. Paladin seek justice for all races. If you ever need your horse reshoed, let me know. If you ever need your horse reshoed, let me know. Butters house? I will check the garage after the this. Of Butters the Merciful. Butters really is a very sweet boy. I hope you'll treat him as you would a normal child. <laughs> That's a fucked up thing to say in its own weird way. The poop that took a pee. Yes. Ah, this Thank must God. be the new kid. We're playing, Dad. Good. You Facebook me right away if Butters does something he should be grounded for. Pubes. Why are there pubes in here? Did you hear this Terrence and Phillips shit? <laughs> Clamato juice, cash, health potion. Man, I'm gonna have to watch some South Park tonight after this. <laughs> let's let's uh, discover the deep dark secrets of Butters. Thank God Butters is here, by the way, because I love Butters. He's like one of my top three characters. Like, I, I still don't know who my favorites are because I love them all. And like, they, they're always changing, but Butters is always in the top three. Raisin's girl picture. Oh man, I'm like, I'm not remembering specifics of some, of some of these things, but chaos layer key. Potion. Chin balls. Alright. Well, you know, the game is like all proud of me for finding that key. I want the chin balls. Oh, Mrs. Mr. Stotch has just sent me a message. I want you to know that I'm very sorry about butters, just in general. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's... Fuck you, new kid. Things were fine until you showed up. I'll get back at you for this, I swear. Fuck you, Clyde. I'm supposed to donate most of my allowance, since this is that's one of the rules of being a paladin. Oh, I can be a ball chinian. <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes!
Yes, Pokemon is in the game there. So what could you do with Chimp Pokemon? I guess it's just for fun. That's awesome. <laughs> boobs. Send all your boobs to Butters. His email address is vinesaucevidja at gmail.com. <laughs> Professor Chaos. Oh man, all these things. I don't even get... I don't remember a lot of them. Oh right, there's perks too, yeah. This is Percocet. This is Percocet. Perks available one. Protect my balls. You take greatly decreased damage when you are critically injured. Um, become... Oh, so you get just one of, of these? How, do, how does this work exactly? I don't want to... Well, inflict damage to and take less damage from burning enemies. Your ranged attack inflicts more damage. Um, become one with the taunt, inflict extra damage. Greatly decrease damage when critically injured. That's a, that's a good one. Oh, so you just you just pick whatever you want. The, like, there's no. I thought maybe you can only do one row, one from one row, but that that works. That Chikala Monroe. Oh, you guys don't know about Chikala Monroe. It's a name that Tyler came up with. Not Monroe, Monroe. Ah, oh, it's time for more shit. If it's how? Precious, it means you get a free wish. How often does my character shit? And why does Butters always watch? Butters loves to watch me take shits. Butters creamy goo. All right, okay, all right. I'm not gonna get anything done in this game ever because I want to read all the, the fucking tips for the things. It is now 34.3 years later and AIDS is still funny. <laughs> I missed a jewelry box, okay. Butter's creamy goo is not a healing potion. Belonged to Inspector, solve the mystery of the White Swallow. Fatty Doo Doo DVD. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what could creamy. What is his creamy goo? What is it? I wonder. This game doesn't tell you a lot, does it? I missed a jewelry box, right? Oh, no, I can't get the jewelry box. I'm too short for that. Ah. Hello and welcome to Progressive. Yes, we're looking to buy car insurance. Well, you've come to the right place. <laughs> it's pretty awesome music. Oh, cool. Is that a chimp Pokemon? Choo choo to zoom me! Cool. I can clear snow now. Druid gloves. Wild, wacky action bike. Cash, speed potion, bangs. Where is his Professor Chaos lab? Grey die, wizard beard, 
Nah, man, my ball chins. That's three Chimpokomon so far. Fast travel location, but horses. <laughs> Thanks, Twitchy Alex. That's nice to hear. Oh, man. Oh, man. I love this game so much already. <laughs> he's, he's the fast travel guy. Many dangers, new kid. Yeah, you moved to the wrong realm. Nice hair, douchebag. That's my name. That's not an insult. Eat shit. Die, asshole. You're hurt. This looks like a job for Paladin Butter. Press the wrong shit. Okay, so Butters has healing touch. I got your back, yo. <laughs> huh, that beat. I better wait a turn before I do any more healing. It's your buddy's, uh, on your buddy's turn, you can use an item or his quick action, then attack. Attacking ends his turn. So use an item or quick action first, okay. Hammer of Justice. All enemies with a massive shock. Feel my righteous fury! I was a little too late there. Ah! Ouch. Hey, look, you're bleeding. Use the examine screen to find out what status effects do. So, well, bleeding is pretty obvious, but... It looks bad. Here, take some of this magic cure potion. How long were they waiting in that snowman? Don't get grounded for waiting in Apothecary's pantry like I do. Lint. <laughs> nice! I stole lint from the dude. Whoa, I'm missing all of my blocks. Alright, that was a little bit better. I'll get there eventually. I'll get used to it. We're still doing this, right? Uh -uh. Ah, Butters, you need healing. Because he got his shield back. You want some of this? There you go, Al. Okay. Okay, I'm getting used to this a little bit. Aw, oh, motherfucker. Ow! Oh shit, Butters is, is bleeding. Stop it. Oh, oh. Butters ah. is gonna die.
He can't healing touch himself. He's gonna use an item. Uh, it's small. Yeah, I have to go to the small. bathroom. <laughs> small health potion. Having balls on one's face seems like a disadvantage in combat. No butters, no. No butters, no. Gotcha. Okay, I'm learning all the little mechanics now. Terrence action figure. And I get to steal their money too. There it is, the iconic sign. Oh, that's fucked. You scared? Asshole! That didn't count. Um. Jesus, Butters. Man, stop it, Butters. Stop getting hit. Man, I could be watching TV right now. Nice. Alright, so I have abilities here. Use them. They regenerate after each battle? That's how you do it. So you, okay, PP regenerates after every battle. Got it. That makes sense. Like, she watched all this happen. She should totally be, like, super impressed. Truth, we must recruit the warriors. Sorry, but we can't be friends until you have more friends. <laughs> Sorry, bird. Burb. Jimmy. I forget, actually, who Jimmy is. When I see his little head, it'll probably... Oh. I'll probably remember. But even so, I mean... It's hard to kind of tell the difference between a lot of the South Park characters anyway. Facebook messaging than I am at speaking. Here, this will just go a lot faster if I friend you. Sure is a lot of walking. Mm. <gasps> <laughs> 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 oh, this game has nudity. Okay. Well, there you go. Now you know what to expect. Kelly Gardner feels we have a real connection. That's pretty cute. Cool. I like how there's just a toilet in the garage. If it splashes, it means you get a free wish. For what reason?
Are you new? Hey, that means you don't know anything about me, huh? Don't, uh, don't believe everything you read on Facebook, okay? I forgot. Don't, uh, from... don't believe everything you read on Facebook, okay? I forgot if he's from an episode or whatever. Or if there was a specific plot point that involved him. I don't even know who that is, honestly. Maybe, maybe there's a South Park fan in here. Who would, uh, who would know better than I. Yeah, you like that? Yeah. Yeah, fuck that snowman. Yeah. Yeah, from what I understand now, there, there, there's more nudity and it gets weird. So, expect, expect that. It'll be a lot of fun. He shit himself at school. Gotcha. You looking for Craig? Well, he can't play. He's in detention. Something about flipping off the principal. We better get to the other guys first. <laughs> Listen to this music. Timber. Oh, the Queef Sisters are on here. <laughs> Jesus fuck. <laughs> I'm just remembering the episode now with the Queef sisters. What was it? Like there was this it was like an equality issue where Terrence and Philip could get away with it, but yet they thought Queefs were disgusting. Whoa, Spock? Someone's a Star Trek fan. CBS is gonna sue someone. Greetings, human. While I would prefer to explore strange worlds with you, it is illogical to abandon the bridge until the captain returns. Mm-hmm. The captain is my mob. I, I can't go outside when she's at home. But the Federation has an right. urgent mission for you. A tricorder was left behind on the frozen planet of Hoth. Only it's not a tricorder, it's my dad's iPad too. I need you to beam down to the Omicron sector and locate that device before it falls into Klingon hands. I think Wait it fell out of my backpack near the church. Okay. But Hoth is... Hoth is not Star Trek. You should know that because... You have, I mean, you've got a fucking Klingon battle cruiser built. And, uh... Skok is on your wall. Well... I'm sure he knows that. He has to know that. He's he's a smart kid. Just broke his robot toy. What the hell is this? Speaking of Hoth, today was Force Friday. Any other nerds going by Star Trek uh Star Wars stuff? See, now I'm getting them confused. Um, I, I did. That's why I went to Target, guys. Well, I mean, I was, you know, amongst other things, I bought a little bit of a, I bought a shirt too, but I mean, you know, that was a Millennium Falcon shirt. Um, no, there was, um, there was some Star Wars stuff from The Force Awakens that came out today. And uh, I bought, a Captain Phasma figure because I figured it'll be worth money someday. So I spent eight dollars on that. Can you believe it? If it's Bashes, it means you get a free wish. Thirty year old men buying action figures. Someone bought a BB eight in the chat? Jesus. Was that expensive? You, you wouldn't believe how many fucking Star Wars types of things there are. There, there's a Star Wars toy for everything. There's Star Wars toilet paper holders. There are Star Wars planetariums that project the Star Wars galaxy. There's, I mean, there is so much shit. Dad, just body a 
No, I don't. I don't buy the Infinity figures. All I bought was the um, the eight dollar figure, just because I figured day one first print custom. <laughs> I'll keep it in the box. I'm not gonna open it. And I bought like a little um, Star Destroyer thing from Micro Machines for like five bucks. Um, and then wait, wait. Yeah, that's about it. Barbecue tongs, yeah, and then they have these little, like, these little dwarf Darth Vaders that look really weird. I swear to God, I saw, like, there's a Darth Vader that's, like, four feet tall or three and a half feet tall. And it's just, like, a, it looks like a blow-up doll, but it's Darth Vader. What's kids doing with the Star Wars toy? Also, what is this right here? Uh, there's something up here that I can't access. That wasn't very nice. No, I didn't. I didn't buy. It. I like BB-8. I think it's it's a cool little droid. He's no Jar Jar Binks. I mean, Jar Jar Binks was the pinnacle. He's the key to all this. You know, if we can get Jar Jar to work, then all of this will work. Charcoal over here. So there's other stuff I can't access yet. I like how the fire is just real fire. <gasps> oh, what? <laughs> Sweet Jesus. Who leaves their door open while they're masturbating in their fucking living room? Lock it. Lock your door! Damn, I got the worst snuggie behind that building over there. It sucked. Have you tried Tweak Brothers coffee? It's terrible, but for some reason, I can't stop drinking it. <gasps> I see something over here I want to get, and then I'll continue with the story. She's gonna try again. Okay, potion s'mores schnapps. Uh, what new friend, Pete? Map. Okay, so we're going to token. So yeah, we're pretty far away from the quest. So let's just let's just go back to token. I don't think I have a fart command yet. Whoever's saying I should fart on them. I don't I don't have that yet. I don't even like donuts. That's the sad truth. Ow! Ow! Ah! You know you can die from a titty twister? <laughs> what? It sounds like something critical would like. City shoes. Right here. I can't grab a shitty sushi! Go to the church. I'm near the tricky quest, Vinny. Okay, where's the... Let's find the church. What button is the quick quick map? There it is. Okay, so the church is... There. He's not Vulcan around. This is where Jimmy gave me that noogie one time. Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. Oh shit, elves. I didn't notice them. You're okay. dead. I thought they were just like playing. They're like cool, cool guys, you know? They're not cool at all. Uh, hey, I'm it. <laughs> ah! Ah! That wasn't so bad. Ah, butters. Butters is always like almost dying. Come on, butters. Eat the candy. Oh, I have candy in the freezer. I just remembered. I have like a frozen Twix. I gotta get in on that in a minute. Now, 
Roger's Fury! Ah. Oh. How'd they survive that? Cover your glue. Don't don't do it. Don't don't kill butters. Suck don't on kill. this! Butters is dead. Butters has ceased to be. He is no more. Revive potion is just a taco. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's amazing. Come on! I'm gonna go for him. There we go. He's still alive. Butters. I think I'm gonna heal Butters with this. Abilities. I don't have any abilities. Never mind. You should be dead. One down. Sixty damage. That's pretty nice. Yeah, that's it, little buddy. Smite him. Nice. You're straight tippy, sir. And Butters is just about dead again. This is so par for the course for Butters. Oh boy! Oh boy! Found it. The iPad. That's not a tricorder. Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. The game makes Butters a target on purpose, so Butters gets priority. We're here. We may as well see what's in the church. Go for the archers first. Okay, I can. Can do that. Tithe. Bag. We aren't really being good teammates here. Uh, can we get back to the quest? The rectory. Faith plus one CD. Boy-sized leash. <laughs> oh, we... That's it. Catholic Church is now banning vine sauce forever. The Hollywood Beard. Cure Potion Cash. St. Peter. The Rabbit. Oh, I remember. Hippitus Hoppitus. And Ghost Patch. If you guys haven't seen the Louis C.K. bit about the Catholic Church, just go to YouTube and type Louis C.K. Catholic Church. It is hysterical, but just, it's fucked up. It is very fucked up. Yet, Something am stinks like human. amazing. So very amazing. I don't even like donuts. That's the sad... I think... Is this the kid's house? No. It's the next one over. I think it's this one. Yeah, I, well, I grew up Catholic. Vinny, turn off the light. Turn off the light in the church, Vinny. Fuck. Alright. I like how this kid poses for his family photos with his Spock ears on. Well done! The galaxy is in your debt. Let it be known that I have been, and will always be, your friend. On Facebook. I like Kevin Stoley. He's he's good. Missile of slowing. Cool. Live long and prosper. Live long and prosper. Rest in peace, Leonard Nimoy. The 
missile of slowing. Oh, okay. I need level four for that. I kind of... Did I check the cabinet at the far right of the Vulcan kid's room? No, I didn't actually. Video game, Shadow of the Col Cyclopses. <laughs> and a Klingon beard. Nice. Nice. It's actually spelled Klingon, too. Like, they're not pulling any punches here. And look, there's the Millennium Falcon. I did not even see that before. And now the Millennium Falcon is broken. <laughs> Shadow of the Cyclopsis. That's the sequel that we never got. Last Guardian at E3 this year did not really impress me. Gotta be honest. It looked... I don't know. I, I already talked about it a lot. I discussed it. And I know a lot of people wouldn't feel the same way. And that's fine. But I just didn't think it looked like anything special. Especially for the weight. Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. It's like the amount of time that was like spent that, you know, people were waiting for this game. And it still looks like a PS3 game. Hey, wait a minute. So. You need to equip patches in your clothes. So wait, what am I doing here again? Vine sauce, the point is that it's being made, not if it impresses you. Like I said, I definitely... I definitely understand that uh, some people think it looks good, and that's, that's cool. It doesn't bother me. Oh, there we go. HP. Oh, I don't have a... I can't do it yet. Pray. You can't do the church yet. Okay, but I was saying... That's like Duke Nukem. We learned that was being made. And that was not impressive. Okay, we're gonna do something... We're gonna go here. But again, you know, that's, that's up to you. That's just my own personal kind of okay, feeling about it. That that's butt Brady! Wait. <laughs> I didn't think it looked amazing, but it, it didn't look terrible. However... However, Shadow of the Colossus, I thought, was one of the best games ever. So there's a lot to live up to for that. New message from Kevin Stoley. What does what my Vulcan friend wish to say? Greetings, human. Incoming transmission from USS Kevin. Okay. <laughs> okay, seriously, Kevin, there's no fucking spaceships on Zeron, okay? Human and elves, they don't have any fucking phasers, they have swords and arrows. Forgive me, Admiral. My Vulcan half does not always prevent me from doing illogical things. <laughs> this is amazing. The Facebook posts are great. This here is the marketplace. This is where heroes can come for adventuring gear, nose jabs, and abortions. <laughs> it's so tempting to just do all of this stuff. Where are your parents? Okay, this is a stick-up. Put all the money in a bag or I'll fucking kill each and every one of you. Hey, Jesus. Hey, Benny. How's it going? Just showing the new kid around. Hi, Butters. Good to see you too, Butters. Thanks for checking in. <laughs> what the hell, Butters? 
It's nice to hear Chef. Welcome to the Bank of South Park. Would you like to invest money with us today? Wise move, young man, and a bold first step towards your financial future. We'll and it's gone. Take that money and employ significant leverage using computer-assisted high-frequency trading and index fund rebalancing to buy ahead of certain stock movements. And it's gone. And it's gone. Did, did I just lose twenty dollars? God damn it! I knew that was gonna happen too. I absolutely knew that was gonna happen, but I did it anyway. <laughs> Weird. Ah! Ah. Yep, all that money's gone. Good. Well, I invested. Sporty glasses, health potion, and cash. Uh, that sucks. And it's gay. Well, it's a tough economy. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? David Hasselhoff. I don't know. I think you have a nice nose. I'd worry more about your hair if I was you. Hello, are you interested in some rhinoplasty? Here's Wait, a Sharon brochure works with here? all of Dr. Tom's rates. Wow, this is... That's a lot of stuff. <sighs> Wrinkles, scars, beauty mark. Back again, I... Back again, I see. The Hasselhoff is 175. Pollen allergies turn you into a crying little bitch. This is for you. For noses which are pretty good but look like shit when viewed from certain angles. For the noses where it's best to tear it all down and rebuild from scratch. Retro glam makeup. I guess this isn't Tom's office. Save up for that. I will save up for the hassle off. That sounds like fun. Truly want to stay out of there if you're a fetus, yeah. Gotta, gotta go in here and check this out. We have to see what this is all about. Bag, we're supposed to be playing the game, not just run around town. Yeah, but it's so much fun, Butters. Hi. Did you accidentally get someone pregnant? Yes. Hi. Did you accidentally get someone pregnant? I, I got Butters pregnant. Why is there a screwdriver in here? You know what? Not even gonna think about that. I could swear I heard a voice coming up from the stairs. It said something like... We will kill them with compassion! Okay. Abilities... Mug. Stop dicking around! Oh, I pressed the wrong button, I think. Spin... And then press A when you see it flash. Hey! I kinda no, fucked that no, one up no, too. No. Whoops. Oh, 
god, I didn't realize it would carry over after attacking. That's stupid of me. There you go, Al. Go to the sewers. Go to my secret home. The sewers. Wait, whose turn is it? Is there a way to pass a turn or you have to attack or do something? Secret home. Man, I could be watching TV. You cannot right pass now. turns. Oh shit. Just, just be dead. Damn butters. <laughs> I'm so sorry, butters. Awesome, okay. Oh wait, no, he's still going. Ah, oh, shit. Butters is dead. No, he's still alive. I, he's so grossed out that he wasn't able to attack properly. I'm just gonna go to um, Token's house now. I I've been fucking delaying this quest for so long. Asses of Fire 2 3D! Oh. If an enemy doesn't have armor, do light attacks. Okay. Still have some, some things to learn, Coral. I saw two rats running around last time I was at Skater's Bar. I'll probably still eat there. Fascinating. This movie is really sweet. Too bad you guys can't see it. Psst. Psst. Hey, over here. Al Don't Gore. worry, I'm not here to hurt you. <laughs> it's me, Al Gore. You know, Al Gore, I'm super important. All right, look, I've detected some very strange activity in this area. I believe we are dealing with Man Bear Pig. Yes, uh -huh. the Man Bear Pig. Expected. I know you're scared, but I need help. Take these and place them in the location specified on the man bear map. Pig. And now I'm going to make you my friend on Facebook. This is very prestigious. <laughs> you have my email now, but don't give it out to anybody. I'm super serial. Hurry! We must know if man bear pig is here or not. Super serial. <laughs> I've always wanted to be friends with Al Gore. This is the best day of my life. I can choose a new perk too. Increase PP. Melee weapon does extra damage. Inflict more damage to stun targets. Debuff supply to less than one turn less than normal. Um, your first attack in combat deals extra damage to PP when you use a healing item. Inflict additional damage against enemy suffering from grossed out. Inflict additional damage to and less from bleeding. Attacks to increase damage. Using a potion now gives you attack up in addition to the potion's usual effect. Yeah, I like that one. Damn it, Al Gore. Why'd you give me another quest? That's me in the big profile picture. I'm talking to you now. 
God damn it, Al Gore. And that's Token's house. This is Tweak. Okay, so we can go get Tweak. Man Bear Pig is on a farm just below Canada. Well, I guess I guess we'll go see Tweak. Welcome to Tweet Coffee. Coffee made with ingredients supplied by local organic suppliers. It's local coffee, brewed locally. Tweak? Tweak? <laughs> Have you picked up the fresh local ingredients? Uh, not yet, Dad. I'm still trying to do all my chores. Well, hurry up, son. The family business is relying on you. <laughs> Tweak had some good episodes. What, didn't he have the underpants gnome? Episode, that was him, right? <laughs> Hello there. If you're looking for Tweak, he's in the back room, unattended. Unattended. Like a pristine meadow known only to the wild horses that graze there. <laughs> you like to try some coffee? It's fresh, like a sun-dappled cornfield, ready for harvest. Speed potion. Power potion. Uh... Speed potion lets you attack again, that's cool. Sorry, I've already got friends. You should try some coffee. It gives you that edge you need to stay focused at school. It's like every hipster fucking coffee shop. You guys gotta see, like, if you've never been to Williamsburg, or even, like, some places like East and West Village in Manhattan, you guys gotta see how many hipster fucking places there are. Like, just coffee shop after coffee shop after coffee shop that's just so hipstered out. Made from the finest twigs. And it's like, it takes them an hour to make because they do it, like, by hand. They crush the... There's no way, man. They crush the beans with their hands. Tweak does all the work around here. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll talk to you later, Tweet. We're a little busy. Ah, oh, never mind. More coffee! Need more coffee! <laughs> hey, my character is like Tweak. The bag's under the eye. Actually, I can change that now, right? Yeah, I can. I'll stick with it for now. What's this? Ah, now? The guys need me now? Well, there's no way, man. There's way too much to do. How am I supposed to do all this? Wait, you. Could you go get the four o'clock delivery for me? If you do, I can finish here and then, and then I'll still have time to play. Please, would you? It's at Kenny's house, like always. Y you give them this, they'll give you the delivery. More coffee. Need more coffee. All right. <laughs> all right, Tweak. Or should I say Gollum? I can't all the work is done. If you get the delivery for me, I can finish here. All right. Let's... Let's take a moment. Um, I want to get something to drink, and I also want to get some of that candy that's in my freezer because uh, it's 2 a.m., and I think 2 a.m. is a great time for candy. Don't you agree? You know how your parents always told you don't eat any candy before bed? Well, that was wrong. Have as much of it as you want. It's delicious. I'll be right back. Maybe uh, two minutes. Quick two minute. BRB. See you in... That's not a BRB. What is that? Uh, that'll, that'll do. All right, see you guys in just a few minutes.
Clyde? Clyde, is that you, Clyde? Do you remember the other day when I was talking to you guys? <clears throat> I looked behind me on my wall. There was a there was a big centipede, a house centipede. Do you remember that? I found another little one. This one was like half its size. Just just today. Mm. I love me some centipedes. And they love me too, clearly. We're best friends. We, they just, they, they squat at my house though. I let them. I don't stop them. They can, you know, if they want to, if they want to stay, they can, they can. Mm. Hey, Big Nose, you should consider having some work done. Wow. <laughs> Ow! Oh! You're an asshole. Oh! All right, we got to deliver some coffee now. Down to... Wait, where is this? Soft tweaks. Hang on a sec. Yeah, we got to go to Kenny's house. Let's go find Man Bear Pig first. Oh, it's the you store it. Hey, do you, does anyone here want to write their essay? I'll give you a good price. What are you you selling stuff? He's selling a sweaty headband, a do rag, and training gloves. Uh, weapon strap ons. Hey, look. Adds five gross damage on perfect attack. Actually, this is. Adds one bleeding. Uh, let's, let's get the, um, let's get the dead bird. I definitely well, trust these health broken. potions. Wait, how do we, um, never mind, there's rats here. I can't do man bear pig. All right, so what we have now is the, um, this is the first one I'm using, but I now have the ability to put this thing on my weapon. That's pretty cool. Oh, look, my, we my weapon's filthy. Now oh, that sucks. What the fuck? <laughs> so anyway, the worst pig deli over there one time. There's um my sword now has my dagger now has an effect on it that allows me to gross out enemies. So it's pretty good. It's pretty good. It seems like a direct upgrade. Um, what did I just look at? Hi, Mr. Slave. Hey, kid, can you help me? There was a mix-up at the post office, and they accidentally gave me a package for Miss Cartman. Any chance you can go to the post office and pick up mine while I drop this one by her house? Okay. <laughs> you know this game is fucked when Mr. Slave is the normal one. <laughs> when I guess Miss Cartman and I like to shop at the same places. When Mr. Slave is like completely fine compared to what's in the next house. Uh, I'm actually I'm actually afraid of what I might find in Mr. Slave's house. Mr. Slave, please please don't disappoint me. <laughs> please don't make it weird, Mr. Slave. Is that his bedroom? Yep, we found his mail. <laughs> oh no. Of course there's a torn condom. Okay. Alright, that's so far not too bad. That's not 
too bad. That's it's it's bad, but okay. Small locket and anchor beard. That's actually not that terrible. I was expecting a lot of weird shit, and Mr. Slave is pretty cool. It's pretty cool, yeah? Small locket, keepsake from a deceased loved one. Oh. This appears to be some kind of balloon for the torn condom. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty cool. Mr. Slave seems like an alright guy. Ever since I'm young, I was hard or gay. Alright, well then again, <laughs> we haven't... We haven't checked the, this. But even this isn't that... Well, no, there's Big Gay Al. There's the, um... Gays Against Fags from the episode. It's, it's a long story. You just you have to see the episode if you don't get it. Gay Walk 1989. And a Boy Scout uniform. Gee whiz. Ah. Playing pirate is better than being a pirate. Who wants to live in streets? Is that a kindergartner? Yeah. Oof! Well, I can fight the kindergartner? I don't think I like you very much. Oh, man. This feels wrong. Ah! Oof! There you go. Yeah, that is a lot more damage. Or at least somewhat more damage. My name is Revolio Clockwork Jr. Fighting kindergartners. Amazing. They're little strong little fuckers, too. Another victory for the good game. Oh, this game is awesome. Not just because you get to beat up kids. There's stupid questions. And there's stupid... Lies about five guys costing $30 for a burger. Skull face paint? That's kind of awesome. Mexican staring frog. Kids are weird. I was never a kid. That's why I can say this. At, at no point in my life was I a child. I, I just... I was shit out. Fully grown with a beard. Like I had my my fucking five o'clock shadow, it fully intact. I hey, am I the pirate king. I am the pirate king. Well, that's that's cute, Ike. But I guess you're just a pirate king then. All right, later, Ike. Ah! Come play hide and seek with us. You're it. I'm assuming they're just going to be all over town, so I'm not going to try to... I'll just keep doing my quests, and if I find them, I find them. And for anyone who's joining us just recently, this is my first time playing this. 
my frost giant is invisible. Giant? <laughs> Slaying the mighty frost giant, I stand in awe of you, hero. I continue to admire your awesomeness. <laughs> oh, Francis, please. Oh, hey, Mr. Broflosky. Welcome to the neighborhood. Hey, if you ever want to sue anybody, you can come to me first, okay? Mr. Broflovsky is uh, Delphinoplasty has worn off. Um, okay, so Mr. Broflovsky, Francis. All right, so I want to do Mr. Slave's package quest. Where's that one? That one is... Do I have to go back to the store or Mrs. Cartman's house? That's the question. Man bear pig. Wait, that's a man bear pig location. So what's a, what's this place? That's also a possible man bear pig location. Okay. Call the banners. Um, Mr. Slave's package. Alright, so that's over there. May as well do this first. I'm here. It's Kenny's house. <laughs> yep, it's Kenny's house. Ugh. There's just fucking feces in the front yard. Hello. Oh god, I have to fight this person? I gotta fight an, ad an adult hobo? <laughs> Crazy hobo. Shank this motherfucker. Dirty old son of a bitch. I got your back, yo. By the hammer of butters. Oh, I gotta spin counterclockwise. That was the most perfect throw I've ever seen. No, 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 no. Imagine this, this this hobo is actually beating the shit out of children with a pipe. A metal pipe. Aw, oh, come on! What I do? Now I'm bleeding. Um You should be dead. Gotta play her up, huh? Oh, oh god, oh god, now he's even filthy. <laughs> oh, and I get attack up, I forgot about that. That's cool. That's not nice. Hey! Keep breaking his arm. I should be using heavy attacks, no? Sorry about this. Too. Almost dead. And now he's even more drunk. <laughs> he's retching all over himself. Homeless camp. There's <laughs> seven homeless camps that I have to find. This game is fucked. Okay, there's rats over there, so I can't go that way. Can we please get back to playing the game? It'll be way more fun than this. Shut up, Butters. I'm having fun. This is the homeless camp. There's a used syringe. <laughs> there's cash. A bindle. Shit-stained badge. And disheveled wig. Out 
talk to the nice people. This is the guest house. I just saw a bong. I saw a bong and bottles. Out. Oh. This, yeah, this yeah, we got the package for Tweet Coffee. You got the envelope? Uh, this is these a meth witch lab. doctors must be cooking up a secret potion. I wonder if it's a healing potion. Uh, um. Hey, that's not the usual kid that picks up the package, huh? Oh, shit. <laughs> no, I gotta fight them now! I don't think I like you, Fight <laughs> like meth heads! Can't wait for the new season of South Park now, Jesus. Yeah, tonight's gonna be a South Park night. Definitely watching that. Feel that righteous fury! I've been watching Fringe a little bit before bed. Uh not crazy about it so far. I explained it to my friend Tyler as because he recommended it. So did Mike, and I, I like it. I don't I don't hate it. It's it's growing on me a little bit, but I'm only like four episodes in. I described it as like the X Files with less likable leads. But I don't know. I, I everyone was telling me to watch it. They thought I would like it, so I'm gonna stick with it. I'm sure it'll get better. I hear the later seasons are awesome. Which, the later seasons of X-Files aren't so awesome, but the middle seasons are amazing. And, like, same thing for Star Trek Next Gen and Deep Space Nine. I always tell people, like, the first two seasons are going to be rough. But once you make it past those, you are rewarded. Oh, I keep missing the thing. I did it, though. Oh, I love Walter. It's amazing. It, that's John Noble's character, right? He is cool. He's, he's my favorite character right now in Fringe. They they are scientists, butters. You, you could say that. They <laughs> they're kind of scientists. In, in their own little way. Tweak special delivery. Wife meter. <laughs> Let's see, what do we have here? Wife beater. Whoa, excuse me. <laughs> Look at this trash that I've become. This fucking, I'm wearing a wife beater. I got on a fucking hood. I got bags under my <laughs> eyes and I got balls on my chin. I, I love this game. I love this game so much. Ah, oh, there you go. Ah, I'm becoming one with the trash. Man bear pig sensor. And I got Kenny's bloody club. It's a new weapon. It says here that Kenny's Bloody Club is a weapon that stands the redneck tradition of sticking some nails in something to make it deadly. It is slightly more powerful than the, the previous one, but, but it only attacks three times. So I'm going to stick with the, the Chris Dagger for now. Guys, can you believe, like, how many great games I've been streaming lately? I went from Metal Gear Solid 3, to Bayonetta 2, to Peace Walker, to Phantom Pain, to this. And Hotline Miami 2 sprinkled in there for good measure. This might be my best, or rather my most favorite, it's like, series of streams I've ever done. Before that, it was Final Fantasy 7, but... That doesn't count because I've I played that before. The other games, these other ones, are the first time I'm, I'm experiencing them. 
Would I ever consider playing Monster Hunter? I am a, a Monster Hunter fan. I have three Monster Hunter games, actually. And I've streamed Monster Hunter 4 quite a bit on the stream. Will I return to it? Maybe. That's a demanding game. I, I go back and forth with it. But I do love it. Monster Hunter is a great series. It's one of my favorites. And uh, I'll definitely get the new one when it comes out in America in five years. Oh, hey, you're the new kid. My sister, the princess, texted me about you. She thinks you're cute. You mean my Kenny? My sister Kenny doesn't need protecting, but watch out for her anyway. I didn't know Kenny had a sister. Or maybe I did and I forgot. I don't know. Look at this trash. Look at this Kenny. Kenny's trash. There's Mysterio costume. He's got some porn. The luchador outfit. The Oh my god, I love it. Cash. Water balloon. NASCAR members club ID. BFF necklace. Rosy cheeks. Toy horse. Purity ring. Sorry, Kenny. The one thing that Kenny had that wasn't broken and fucked was that skateboard, and I just broke it. Coffin glasses. Alabama man. Rat poison. You, oh, Kenny. Kenny has rat poison in his room. Sorry to hear about the renters. Usually they're real fun and energetic. If you see Kenny, tell him to pick up some dinner on his way home. Not them fancy toaster strudels, though. Just regular Pop-Tarts. If you see Kenny, tell him to pick up some dinner on his way home. Not them fancy toaster strudels, though. Just regular Pop-Tarts. Gazunga's Gentleman's Magazine. <laughs> White Trash and Trouble VHS. All right, guys, anyone here who's a big South Park fan, you can only choose one episode that's your favorite. I know that's tough with like nearly 20 seasons, but if you had to choose one episode, what would it be? I'm trying to think of mine. I think um, the one where Stan, the two-parter where Stan thinks everything's shit with the duck that likes vomits. Chim Pokemon you like, gay fish, the F word, the anime episode. Imagination Land was a lot of fun. I like that one. Scott Tennerman must die with Radiohead in it. That was awesome. Uh, City Walk, <laughs> Cock Magic. Yeah, that's a good one. The World of Warcraft one for nostalgia. Yeah, I, I, I can see that. It wasn't that funny, but it, nostalgia was good. Um, the Scott Tennerman was great. Fish Sticks was great. The Trapped in the Closet was great. The Coon Saga was great. The Game of Thrones one was cool. The anime one was amazing. But if I had to choose one, and I don't know the name of this episode, it's it's the one, like I was saying, is the two-parter where Stan just thinks everything's shit. You'll pay for that. Ah. <laughs> and, um... He has, like, he finds out it. why, as he gets older, everything really is shit. <laughs> it's just perfect. Um, right, we got archers. Yeah. Feel that righteous fury! One archer's down. The armor's Asshole! <laughs> wow, those fuckers do a lot of damage. I don't have many revive potions left. I gotta get more of those. Nice. Ah, 
please. I'm gonna go for the speed potion. Oh, he's just, I guess he's just armored, period. Wait, how's this? I don't know how that works. Stay on, stay on. Oh, when Randy's you bouncing on the balls. Oh my God. <laughs> so just the music alone when that happens, I press the wrong button. Whoops. I'm under your glue. Status effect is different. Helmet with the number above their name is the armor level. Okay. Dark Berkmer. Sorry. Probably just woke someone up with that. I continue to admire your awesomeness. You have slain the mighty frost giant. I stand in awe of you, hero. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to do the Cartman mission real quick. That one, uh, not the Cartman, Mr. Slave. I heard, uh, yes. I want to do that one. Where is that one? That is right there, Mr. Slave's package. Stay on. Well, this is Stan's house, but he is yes! here right now. Randy. Randy is it also in my top three. Like, Randy is generally, like, the best or second best part of everything he's in. Hey, guys, grab a beer and join me for Sports Center. <laughs> but I'm a kid. Uh, Stan's out playing that game, too. I wanted to come, but he wouldn't let me, so I'm drinking beer instead. Hey, guys, grab a beer and join me for Sports Center. <laughs> Randy, why Stan, are you... there's a mess in the living room. Randy just fucking nonchalant, nonchalantly offering children beer. Pan flutist. Randy has so many good episodes. He's just, he's such a good character. It's always like. He's always... <laughs> what was the one? It's like it's a ghost. Gotta go get some internet out west now. They say there's some internet around here, around these parts. And then Randy closes himself in the room and it's like just covered. And he's like, it was a ghost. It's ectoplasm. You were casually, cordially invited to the annual blood orgy. Right up, right down, right. Okay. I don't know what the hell that is. School book. Calculator. Stan ground scouts. Picture of Wendy. Stan's mud beard. Sparky's leech. Leash. Sea man. Action figure. That's Sea man! What was it? Right up, right down, right. Right up, right down, right. I'm never coming out! Oh. I'm never coming out. He's still in there. I'm never coming out. <laughs> it's still, it's, how many years has it been since that episode? Who the fuck are you? Oh, I'm going to kill you, turd. No, Shelly, Shelly, please. Who the fuck are you? I'm going to kill you, turd. Stan's dad takes, takes big shits. <laughs> Thanks, putters. If it's precious, it means you get a free wish. Didn't Tyler said something yesterday about how he takes bigger shits than Bono after after eating Domino's? Oh man, I thought 
thought we were going to have fun. That's uh, a direct reference to Randy taking massive shits. The Sword of a Thousand Truths. Oh shit, we found it. I don't want to sell that one. I want to use it. Yeah. The shake weight. We need one more underpants. A whole 26 Kurigs. <laughs> 2005 Trapped in the Closet aired, so that's been... Is that part of your game, breaking shit? Sorry, Randy. Um, it's been 10 years and he's still in the closet. Does Vinny have a testicle chin? I'm using stealth. You can't see me. Shut up, Bradley. Ow! And I think we're now back to Cartman's house, yeah? We looped around. I'll take the fast travel to the uh, store now. Actually, I'm, I'm probably so close to the store, I don't even need to fast travel. Let's find out. Yeah, it's right up there. It's pretty close. <laughs> because why not? Rapper beard. Some people say we are not rappers. We're rappers. I saw two rats running around last time I was at Skater's Bar. I'll probably still eat there. That's the second time I heard that about Skater's Bar. That place must really suck balls. <coughs> Community board. Monster Mash. City Sushi. <laughs> Who is the coon? Have you seen this Mexican? Answers to Mantequila. Stand up for your rights. Need to tame a horse in Minecraft? <laughs> Timmy and the Lords of the Underworld. I feel like there's a Give reason. It back. Give it back! Why don't you make us? That's my Justin Bieber toy. Not anymore, it's not. Aw, did Baby lose her toy? Who is this? Beat it, kid, if you know it's good for you. Nope, not beating it. But... Please don't ask me, homie. I've got balls on my chin, if you're interested in that. A voice coming up from the sewers. It said something like, "Hody how." That was so amazing. Hody how? Did for me. I won't forget it. I know who's down there. Yeah. We gotta pay a visit at some point. Maybe not today, but some point we have to pay a visit to our old friend. Pokemon! Am I getting too excited when I pick up Pokemon? Chim Pokemon, sorry. Because I think I might be getting too excited. Oh, 
what sad times these are when the nation's youth run around in dungeon clothes playing the games of Satan. Young man, if you really want power, there is only one thing you must do. Find Jesus. Find him, and when you do, return to me. Find Christ, my son, and you shall be greatly rewarded. Where is Christ? <laughs> I have to find Christ now. Jesus. How many people worldwide for eons have been searching for Christ? But I, I got this. I'll, I'll find the Lord. Oh, I did pass this door, by the way. Yeah, I did. Whoops. All right, no problem. We'll go back. I'll go to the church. Let's first do Mr. Slave's package, then I'll go to the church. Stay out of the lost forest. Sure, it's got treasure, but they say there's no way out. It's the post office. I love this song. <laughs> I've got something in my pocket for you, so I'm gonna die from laughing too much. Your brains are going on the fucking wall. Hey, Vince, how's it going? Just showing the new kid around today. Yeah, already been to the bank. Hey, butters, sweet kid. Jesus Christ, butters. I'd love to chat, but you're unpopular. I've got something in my pocket for you. I've got something in my pocket for you. Why don't you see what's in the pocket? I've got it in my pocket. See what's in my pocket for you. Is that a dildo? Bouncing around there. Yeah, that looks like a that looks like a dildo. Mr. Slave's package is is uh G. Wait, no, no, it's not a dildo. I'm sorry, it's a package. Hey, big it's, nose, you should I don't consider know what having is. some work done. Oh. Um. Yeah, I wonder what could, what could that be? I wonder, Mr. Slave's package. Be bouncing around or vibrating. It's definitely not a dildo or anything like that, but it, it is. It's it's bouncing and it's weird, and it's like shaped. Well, it, it's shaped a little like a big mushroom. Do you guys remember that story from China where where they saw they found what they thought was a mushroom, and they put it in like a bucket of water, and the news reporter was like, "What is this mushroom?" And it was just a double flashlight, just without the package, without the casing. And it was like a flesh color. And they're like, this strange mushroom has been reported in other regions of China. The, the, <laughs> the big mushroom. Yeah, that was that was going around again recently on the Internet. And you can see, like, it was, it was, like, clearly a pussy. Clearly. But, they didn't realize it, and they covered it, and people are, like, touching it and, like, poking at it while it's in a bucket of water. And <laughs> they're making up shit, like, they know what this mushroom is, this rare and mysterious mushroom. Um, and then, like, there's one guy... Who's like, yeah, I don't know what that is. Definitely a mystery. And you can tell he totally knows what it is. He just doesn't want to say anything. What's that? Perk bear oh, chicken bones. Oh, that is so funny. It was not the onion. This was real. I'm sure someone could find it and link it. There it is. Yeah. Yeah. Someone linked it in the chat. It's an amazing video. Anyway. Thanks, kid. 
My night is looking a whole lot better now. Here, if you ever need my help, use this. I can't help with any tough fights, though. I don't want to get a fissure. Come back and find me if you want to call me again. But give it a day. I go to a lot of parties. Look at that package. That package is definitely... Rawhide Whip Summon Unlocked. Oh, okay, Mr. Slave is a summon. That package is, is totally... That's just a mushroom. It's just a mushroom. No, I'm not going to do it now. Hang on one sec. I closed the chat by accident. I was going to look at it. And look at the mushroom, I mean. But uh, I've decided against it. All right, let's keep going. Oh, uh, the church, right? Could use a shortcut. That would be nice. secret or maybe not such a secret but we must get back to the question hand my lord <laughs> I can't get past here, even if I unlock it. Any suggestions? Or am I just completely in the wrong place for now? Can't do anything, so. Oh, it opens at the gate. Okay. Oh, shit. I found the chaos. You have tripped about a chaos alarm, and now the earth shall be destroyed in 10 seconds. Butters, turn it off. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Go! And now all these lights and electrical equipment you see are on and will never be turned off. Draining the Earth's entire power supply and plunging humanity into a deep cold darkness. Without lights or heat or computers or power, humans will be left to defend themselves against beasts and elements. Humanity be damned! <laughs> Butters is pretending like he's not Professor Chaos. Dougie spoke of you and says you'd make a worthy ally. Professor Chaos left me here to keep changing the light bulbs until the Earth's energy supply is <laughs> I love that. I love how he's just in the dark room all the time. Bruce Valanche headshot. Mysterion picture. Butters is squirrel nose. Mysterion sightings. Who is he? Could be any of them. Definitely not well, Kenny. We must have stumbled upon the secret and cool lair of a super evil, super cool, super genius. What was that? I know what that is. Burk, burk! Badge. 
cool. So, not a whole lot to do here, but it's kind of cool. It's just, as a fan of the show, it's just awesome to be able to, like, see all this stuff. <laughs> be able to walk around in it. You know, and I'm not talking, like, the fucking... The game that was on the N64. Developed by Acclaim. Which was, um, a first-person shooter where you throw piss snowballs at people. That was a little different. That wasn't that amazing. I played it anyway, though. It was, you know, what else was there to play? It's like when you were a kid, you had Torok, Goldeneye, and South Park game, and that was it. <laughs> Yourself feel slaughter time between 6 a.m. and 10 a.m. <laughs> Isn't this where I had to, um, no, I mean, in terms of first person shooters, you know, it, Ocarina was a whole different story, but like, if you're gonna play a first person shooter on the N64, oh, there we go, I placed it. But, uh, yeah. But then there was a few other South Park N64 games, one of which I corrupted fairly recently. Chef's Love Shack was the one I think I corrupted, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh shit, a filthy old bum. Perfect Dark was amazing. Yeah, yeah, but that was later on. I gotta fight his rats too now? We're gonna summon. Get another one each day. We, we gotta see what this is all about. Jesus Christ. Oh, where did it go? Another where, victory for the good game. Where did the hobo go? He disappeared. I didn't know Mr. Slave was a magician. You're straight up crazy, Mr. Slave. Just, it was just a magic trick. That's all it was. It's just a magic trick. Why did no one teach these kids to not collect pubes? I just want to know. Like, why, why are they collecting pubes? Billy tried to steal my hiding spot, but I made him go away. This game. This fucking game. Ow. I missed a kid at the farm. Okay, I have to go back there then. Not now. I don't think I'm gonna be playing this. Like it's getting late. I don't I don't know how long I'm gonna be playing this for. Probably another twenty minutes. But I'll I'll do a few other little things. Do a few more quests. Um, what was the one? 
post office. Uh, right, quest. Man, bear, pig. Yeah, yeah. Go to the church. We've got two quests over here. Two quests. Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. I found you, Jesus. You was hiding. You found me. <laughs> Next time finding me won't be so easy. <laughs> it's a special banner just for that. Oh, we got to talk to uh, Father Maxi. Man burp pick. Potion, generic sunglasses, untidy wigs, spoiled city sushi, and wing CD. Oh god, wing. Yeah, I remember wing. To get the stick of truth, we must recruit the Warriors 3. Return to Al Gore. I have to talk to the pastor first. Okay. Someone was like, go back to the church. This is my first time. Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. Playing this game, yeah. Um. General Disarray, Mr. Slave. So, okay, hang on a second. Father Maxi's over here. There he is. Do not despair, for many find Jesus only to lose him later. But the soul that does not abandon its search will surely be rewarded with his company. Remember that. Okay. The Lord shall make himself known when he chooses to reveal himself. But he will only reveal himself to those who wish to find him. So now, I guess I'm going to go back to... church to find Jesus again. The right stick does nothing. Hear you, Jesus. Stop, stop this. Stop these silly games, Jesus. I know where you are. I know you're hiding. Okay, maybe I don't know where you are, but I hear you. I got you, Jesus. Uh, well done, my son. I hope you didn't peek. Remember, I will always be at the side of those who have found me. You can call me once per day with this, but I can't help against bosses. They're scary. <laughs> Come find me again for another. Yes, level three. And we have new friends and a new summon. Fuck yeah. Got Jesus on Facebook. Ten fire damage on perfect. Attack, that sounds like a lot of... Sounds like a lot of damage. I like that one. I can't change Butters' stuff, right? Like, Butters is just... That's... He's just who he is, yes?
No, bro, we're going to go to church and chill. You know, come over. We'll we'll pray. We'll chill. You know, do the pray and chill thing. It's cool. Some natty ice. Oh. All right, right upgrades. Um. A new perk available too. Um, PP increased by twenty percent. I think that'll be that'll be good. Extra PP, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade my. Oh, that's level six. Those are higher levels. I'm gonna upgrade the backstab. I want to try the uh, summon. Lock and load. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, I wanted to show mercy. So, how do you get your summons back? How do you have to like talk to them again, or or how does that work? I don't even like donuts. That's the sad truth. Uh, let's go see. Let's go see Tweak. You wait another day. Oh, you sleep. Okay. You talk to them again, they will give you the item. Oh, okay, so those are really, really rare then. Because you- well, not rare, but like... You don't want to just waste them. The days pass as you progress through the story. Okay, well I just wasted them, so... That's pretty cool. While I'm here, I'm gonna go get that kid. I have not done a whole lot of story stuff at all, have I? You're a douche. Oh, fuck off. Ah, oh, you founded me. Fuck you, asshole. None of the summons work on bosses. Okay, so, well, if that's the case, then it's not too bad. Today's delivery. Right here. Hmm. Yep. That's good shit. <laughs> All right, Tweak. You can play for a little bit, but be home before dark, or you'll be grounded. Grounded. Like the fresh grinds of our all-organic Tweak blend, made with ingredients from local tweakers. Thanks, kid. I gotta go get changed, and then I'll meet you at the kingdom. Thanks, London. Hey, did anyone pick up the, um, Star Wars Aftermath book? Just to be a nerd for a second again? If you ever want some work done on your It's nose, the book that Dr. takes place Tom. after He's Return of the Jedi. Jedi. It's- it's one of the first officially canon novels in the Star Wars universe. I missed the chest. Whoops. Just curious if it's any good. Don't 
Thanks, Snuff Pop. Friar gloves, friar robes, cash, round rim shades, John Lennon glasses, as I call them, power potion and speed potion. Don't talk to Al Gore. I love my wolf security system. I refuse. Don't talk to Al Gore. I can't use the, the Friar stuff. I could use the Friar robes. Increases max HP by five, but Friar robes also regenerate stash of cheesy poofs heal five each turn that's cool of course you know we're gonna die green of course oh there's a secondary die color too so that will be green and The same color as the hood could go for green and purple, but that's that's too easy. Well, well. This elf is gonna fuck hey, you up. Hey, you see a <laughs> okay, I won't talk Let's to Al Gore this. yet because people are saying I'm gonna get my ass kicked. Son of a biscuit, little hamburgers. <laughs> You're straight pippin, son. On the uh, well, butters might that die. Sucks. Yeah, butters might die, so I'm just gonna heal him, whatever. Just in case. Well, what's. It doesn't really even matter if he dies, does it? This is the best Paper Mario game I've played in years. Yeah, 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 yeah. You have to prove your maturity, the sealer's booby, and you can't because you're not a sufficient egg. Oh, yeah? Well, guess what I got? Paper Parker Bear! Dark Meadows. Oh god, does Token really live at a place called Dark Meadows? I don't know why I'm surprised at this. This, this is, is South Park. Community, sir. We do not allow in the riffraff. Move along, sir. What the fuck? No! If you try again, <laughs> I will pepper spray you back to the Stone Age. Posted a video of you getting pepper sprayed. Hold up, I gotta watch that again. It's even better when you know what's coming. God damn it. Jimbo's guns carries a selection of gas masks that render pepper spray totally useless as a self defense. Come visit. Back to the Stone Age. Oh man, I remember getting beat 
up right over here. My shitty sushi. So now, oh, Jimbo's guns. It's right down this way. I'm so tempted to just go into all of I these places. A lot of fucking damage. Feel my righteous fury. I know Valley's didn't solve anything, but I kinda like it. Wombo combo wrecked. I'm still pissed about that $20 I lost to the bank. And it's gay. Mangarian. <laughs> City walk. City sushi. The Tower of Peace in between them. Oh, that's an episode I might want to rewatch. Jimbo's guns. This is like the early days of South Park now. Well, hello there, Jimbo and Ned. Well, what brings you here today? Business or pleasure? Or vengeance? Vengeance! You've come to the right place. But you don't see these guys too much anymore, do you? Every now and then, they pop in. Like, off Officer Bar Brady doesn't show up a whole lot anymore. He's kind of a one-trick guy. I like the detective that they use. The ginger detective. He's... I like him a Howdy lot. Howdy there. It, Haven't seen you before. You must be the new kid that moved to town. And you're into hunting, huh? Well, my boy, you've come to the right place. South Park is chock full of things to shoot that would delight any taxidermist, survivalist, or weekend animal death enthusiast. Ain't much I can sell to a miner, thanks to the stupid Democrats. But, <laughs> but if you could prove yourself a real hunter, I might be able to get you some better stuff. You should buy a copy of The Hunter's Guide to South Park Wildlife, th this book thing you hear. Well, first, I want to sell. I got to sell all my junk. Sadly, that means I have to sell... Well, blow up dolls. I have to sell all this cool shit. I have to sell the Black Thunder and the Jack Rabbit, guys. <laughs> Everything has been sold. The Guide to South Park Wildlife is everything a hunter needs to know about the beasts of Central Colorado. Got some things for... Whoa, look at these weapons. Jimbo's hunting crossbow, immune to all forms of gun control. <laughs> Jesus, look at, look at its attack power, too. Warrior's longsword, compensating cousin of the short sword. Awesome sword from the best store in the mall. Not meant to be used as a toy. Protects against the stinkiest gas attacks. We need that. Everything else is like really. Oh, I guess I can get that. You kill anything in that guide, you come back and see old Jibbo and Ned. The best part of hunting is bragging about it to other hunters. Moldy sausage. <laughs> That's a good band name. Defeat the blood sucking fruit bat. Oh, wow. Defeat the penis mouse. Oh, I remember the penis mouse. That was a great episode. The penis mouse episode was amazing. Uh, 
Um, it's one of those beasts I told you about. You'll have to use one of the items I gave you to tempt them out. Conspiracy articles. How do I know if you're being... How do you know if you're being followed? Listening devices. Who to trust? Parents. In on it. I didn't mean to post that. How do I delete it? God, I saw that dumpster and I was going to hide in it. Like in Metal Gear 5. I've been playing a little bit of the side missions of Phantom Pain. It, it is such a good game. I, I did some of the side stuff that isn't too story related. I do have, I listened to some of the tapes and I can sum up some of the things that happen a little bit. Like for example, Miller was attacked by Mist Squad and he talks about that. Um, a few other little things I could mention when, when we stream that again. When I stream that again, we'll talk more about the events between Peace Walker and Phantom Pain. Um, I or rather, you, sir, Ground Zeroes. I have five years training. Whoops. I Sir, I'm a professional security guard. It bar. is impossible we'll to get past me. Either. That's probably going to be one of my games of the year. I think. The uh, Phantom Pain. It's so far, it's rubbing every part of my clit <laughs> the right way. I'm surprised that's, that's actually the first time I saved. Like, manually. Alright, so I have to actually equip the thing. Uh, that's nice. Oh, what is this? Adds one armor, reducing enemy attacks. Reduces gross-out damage by 25. The hood does defense down on perfect attacks versus bleeding targets. This is a gated community, sir. Sir. What the fuck? Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna send you straight to heck. Ow! I like this security guard. By the hammer of letters. Oh! I'm sorry. Yeah. I'll remember your glyph. Again, the best part about this is that he's beating the shit out of kids. Ow! Ooh. He's got 20 armor. Those are the wrong attacks. I did set his hair on fire, though. That's kind of cool. Bad. Move along. Oh, boy. Billy Club of Smiting. Let's use the Billy Club of Smiting, perhaps. Times two on perfect attack lowers target's defense. Uh, it's it's kind of good, but it still doesn't have as many attacks as the dagger. I wonder if there's a bass guitar somewhere in, in his basement or in his garage. Yep, there's the bass guitar! <laughs> Fryer cap. Cash. Waiter, uh, water balloon. Waiter balloon, wow. Token wig. Barry Bonds bat. Okama Game Sphere. Another bass! <laughs> that, was, that was a fun episode, too. The one with the bass guitar in it. What a shitty bass if it only sells for like a buck. Let's go back down. It's gotta be some kind of side quest. Alright, so I wanna put on the, um... Maybe the Friar Cap. Gain one PP when healed. Dipped in holy water when no one was looking. Or... The Hood. Defense down on perfect attacks against versus bleeding targets. So this is, this is a good Hood. Specifically for well, it looks it looks cool, and I get you can see my balls better. Is 
Oh, that, that's cool. That's cool, too. Is that a chain perk of bear? Air, air. Oh, perk of bear. <laughs> Why pubes? Why pubes? Also, what the fuck did I just get? I think, uh... A thing. A thing. Yeah? Can I help you? <laughs> What's this? Oh, the elf stick the stick again? Hang on a second. Thank you for thy message, traveler. I shall make chase <laughs> to Koopa Keep. Mom, can you drive me to Eric's house? T tokens wearing like a, a, a bootleg Nike headband. I love Token too. Token, Token's a fun character. Druid gloves I can't wear yet, but I got the Friar gloves. Uh, thieves gloves gain additional money. Let's do this one. Healing abilities recover 10 more HP. You gain an additional 25 HP from healing. That's pretty good. We gotta keep with the color scheme. I like that you can dye all your armor. It's pretty cool. Move along, sir. I can't look at you without feelings of deep personal shame. Um, let's take a look and see what else we have. Man Bear Pig, Big Hunting, the Timmy Express. Unlock all of them. Uh, hide and seek. Underwear is still... We need some more underwear. Like, just one more. Hide and seek is still going on. Um. I think. Are we ready to return to Cartman yet? Or. Big game hunting with Jimbo's over there. Call the banners. Return to Cartman. Well, well let's, let's return to Cartman. And then we will, um. After that, the stream's gonna end right after this story with Cartman, and then, then I'll check the art, and then we'll talk about my next stream, which will probably be the Phantom Pain. Uh, Sunday, I'm considering Tamadachi. I've been thinking about it. We have some unfinished business with Two Faced, but I have some other stuff for Sunday too. My Eric certainly has a lot of little playmates. He's such a friendly boy. Oh! Not without my anus. Well, soldiers, reporting for duty, Grand Wizard. Nice work, douchebag. Now all my men are here and ready to fight for the. Wait a minute. Where's Feldspar? Where's my level 12 thief? Uh, hey, yeah. Where's Craig? He's in detention. What? He flipped off the principal, so he's in detention again! Oh my god. If they've locked away our thief in detention, we have no hope of getting back the Stick of Truth. We have to break him out. Ah! No way, ma'am! Last time we broke Craig out of detention, we all got in trouble! Getting into trouble is a risk that Douchebag is willing to take! You have to break out our thief, Douchebag. But don't worry, I will not let you go unprepared. I'm going to teach you how to use magic. Meet me at the training barracks. It's time for you to learn Dragon Shout. Uh-oh. Skyrim parody time. Welcome to our base. All are welcome here, even those with chronic medical conditions. At first, I didn't want to join the KKK at all, but the Grand Wizard made some really good points. <laughs> <laughs> you fight well, douchebag, but to truly succeed in combat, you must learn to harness the power of your fight. Farting on an opponent at precisely the right time is key to battle. I shall show you how it's done, but first, you must take the gentleman's oath. You must promise to never, ever fart on anyone's bows, okay? Farting on an opponent is necessary, but <laughs> farting on someone's bows is not cool. Do you understand? All right, then let's begin your training. To conjure dragon shouts, you must first clear your mind and take in a deep breath through your butthole. 
Like so. Hey. Then let it rumble inside you and drag it out. <laughs> I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Drag it out. Now you. Ready? <laughs> drag it out. Find the frequency. Hold. Hold. No. <laughs> Come on, you have to trap the air. It's like a fart, but in reverse. I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon out. Now you. Ready? Oh, okay. Dragon out. Find the frequency. Hold. Hold. <laughs> what do you mean? No, no, that was like a dragon peep. You gotta let it all out. It's a mighty roar. I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon out. Now you. Ready? Dragon out. Okay. Find the frequency. So Hold. Hold. There you go. You gotta press. God, you gotta go from down to up a on the right stick. hundred years and never again witness a spell so boisterous. Could it be that the prophecies are true? Could it be that the dragonborn has come at last in our hour of need? Now let us try your skill on a real opponent. Hey, hey, Princess Kenny. <laughs> Could you come here a sec? <laughs> Shh, don't time. Okay, just real quick, Princess Kenny. Sir Deucebag <laughs> wants to show you something. All right, you two, spar. Kenny's dressed like Zelda. Show Princess Kenny the magical powers I have taught you. <laughs> that was fucking there hilarious. It is. <laughs> no more trouble farting for me. <laughs> oh, okay, good job, Sir Douchebag. That was sweet. Thanks, Princess Kenny. That's all for now. <laughs> okay, okay, but dude, seriously, remember, don't ever do that on someone's boss. Okay, seriously. <laughs> you have mastered dragon shafts. From now on, it will be easier for you. Kenny will assist you on your quest, douchebag. Now go get Craig while I rest and relax upon my throne. Can't talk. Need to practice. Ah! Oh, Kenny's my new buddy. Right, cool. Um, that'll be a good spot to save, I think, right here. Koopa Keep. 3.15 a.m. Yeah, that's good. Oh, this game is awesome. I love this, guys. This is this is a lot of fun. I forgot who bought this for me, but thank you. It was a, it was a few months ago. We'll buy equipment and do all the other stuff next time I stream. Um, now, however, I'm going to um, show the art. So give me just a second. Let me pull up the art. And let's see what you guys drew tonight. Let's see. Eh, eh, yeah, er, er, yeah, nah. er, yeah. There we go. All right, we got some. We got some good art. Um. All right, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where is the last piece of art that I have not seen? Maybe this. Any in chat? I think that's for me. Okay, from Kiss Jelly, The Adventures of Big Boss and Didi. That's awesome. From Malacious, Vine Sauce 2 quality streams that's pretty good i like that i like i like the way you did the, the text actually really like that nice hotline miami 2 style very cool this one's a gif from androsia that's awesome vine sauce will be right back i really like that from KLK155, <laughs> Vinny in chat, Chamber Jam. Yeah, Choice Chamber. I, I'm definitely going to stream that again, but I'm turning off the sub bonuses. 
so sorry to anyone that liked that. I just felt like it was too cash grabby for me. And it was it was very, very easy to lose sight of why people sub, which is because they want to do something nice for a streamer. And people were just subbing because they were on the screen. And it's like, listen, I don't need your money. If you don't have that much money, don't do it. But people were just doing it. And it was like making me uncomfortable. Um, so if I play it again, it'll be fun. But no more of that sub shit. Also, there's another game, too. I forget what the hell it's called. It was recommended. There's another game with Twitch functionality, and that should be a fun stream as well. From Dr. Pretentious, here's uh, Sponge with the with his eye patch. Big, big Sponge. From Tripsy Nostalgic. That's awesome. Just a bunch of various vine sauce related things from the streams. It's pretty damn cool. Uh, okay, so from Garrett Y. Fucking, fucking talk, you elf. From X Alpha Centauri. Is that Kenny? <laughs> yep, it's Kenny as the princess. From Chill Storms. There's, there's me. Um, from Alpha Centauri again, Vinny X Louis C K. From Crow, there's me, Joel, and Rev. Why is Rev dead? It doesn't matter. It was Hasselhoff's fault. It was it definitely Hasselhoff. From Menadon, there's a Vine Shroom inspired by Binding of Isaac. It's tagged as Isaac, so I I used I used reasoning and uh. My deductive reasoning skills as a master detective. From Matthew Me, this is um, a vine, uh, South Park Vine Shroom, actually, which is really cool. And simple, a simple concept, but it works really well. It's the Terrence and Phillip head with the Vine Shroom hat. It's kind of perfect, isn't it? From Pixel Pie 14, if it splashes, you get a free wish at what cost? From Alex Joe 957. Whoa, easy butters. You better shut up and die, bitch, or get my money, you poor hobo. The Pirate King. Whoa. You you won't make From Shoney Griffox. Nice. It's me playing a 3DS <laughs> in South Park. But I graffitied on the on the sign. I love it. I, really great. From Cuckoo Banana. Okay, so if you missed it, I was telling the story of how there was um, a cat on my front step earlier when I came home. And I, I walked very slowly over to the cat because I didn't want to frighten the cat. This is the neighborhood cat. I think his name is Charlie or Oscar. <laughs> I know those are two very different names, but I really, legit, I legit do not remember the name of this cat. So it's one of those two. Really nice cat, really nice temperament, and really, really, it looks clean for, you know, a str like a stray backyard cat. And the neighbors feed it and everything. Anyway, um, I pet it, and I, I joked that I probably have AIDS now. So, Cuckoo Banana, I enjoy this piece of art. High quality. From Shark Bits, there's my character from the South Park game, but uh, art style's a little bit different. A little bit more realistic, I guess. If you want to put it like that. Um, this one's from C. And there's, again, a different take on the South Park style. I really like this. You have Kenny as the princess. You have Cartman as the the KKK Grand Wizard. And then you have me and Butters. I like how when when you guys draw me in a, uh, my character as a slightly more realistic version, the balls aren't on the chin. It's probably for the best. But this is uh, a nice piece of art and a memento for, I, I think, a really fun stream. I loved 
tonight's stream, guys. Thank you for joining me. This was a lot of fun. Uh, this game is awesome, and uh, I can't wait to dive back into it. Maybe not this weekend. I think uh, if I stream anything tomorrow, it'll be Phantom Pain and uh, maybe something else. I have a lot of games on the back burner, but I've been so interested in playing Phantom Pain. I've been playing so much of it, and it's it's so much fun, so I'll probably be streaming a little bit more of that. But I think there's a definite, you know, I got to mix it up a little bit. So Splatoon will be next week, for example. Definitely going to sneak in a Splatoon stream. Um, check out the new stuff. Darkest Dungeon and FTL, like a bunch of games like that, I, I definitely want to get to as well. Whether I will or not, you never know. And this weekend, this Sunday, expect most likely Tamadachi, followed by I have a really interesting horror game, recommended by Critical, actually. And I have um, a bunch of shovelware, and I have some other weird stuff. So I've I've got a lot of good things to stream for you guys, and I'm I'm definitely looking forward to getting to it. But I'm slightly more looking forward to, you know, getting Big Boss to clear out an entire base without being seen. That's how good that game is. So, all right. Good night, everyone. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.